Uh, all right, sweet. So what's what's the TripAdvisor rating for a loft then? What are we looking at here? We five star, four star, three star. Astar. Astar. <laughs> wow, that was a pissed off Irish woman. <laughs> it's a fucking rip off, is what it is. <laughs> She might be staying. Are you staying at a loft? No, she's easy. She stay, she's easy. <laughs> what the fuck's that got to do with anything? She's easy. <laughs> she's just staying whoever will have her, you know. Just at the bar later on in the second section. I need a hotel room. <laughs> I've got actual tits so I can do that. That's, that's, I've got fucking netball tits. That's um, year 10. No, that's weird. That's weird. <laughs> oh, shit. So you're, you're staying at Easy. What's, what's Easy? Is that like the Easy Jet Hotel? No. Oh, it's just, it's just a hotel called Easy. Although, there's a lot of cutbacks. There's a lot of cutbacks? It's a bit budgety. It's a bit budgety. All right, fucking hell. It's a bit budgety. So, you, so how come you're staying there? This is just, we're putting you on hold, by the way, Ollie. So you and your incest, just stop there for a minute. We're moving over here. So you're staying at Easy Hotel. Uh, who, are you, who, who are you staying with? Your weekend lesbian lover, by the looks of it. Well, this gig has taken a turn for the more interesting, hasn't it? I love it when we're just on a normal path of a gig. Do, 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 do. And then all of a sudden, someone goes, she's my weekend lesbian lover. And we go, what the fuck? Your weekend lesbian lover. I love how, like, night, like, Monday to Friday, you're like, I fucking love the day. But, like, on the weekends, you're like, give me some fudge. That's... She's not interested. She's what, sorry? She's not interested. Right, Okay. <laughs> Well, I'm interested in watching, if that counts. I mean, <laughs> sat there at the Easy Hotel up in a loft going, hello, come on. Um, so, so, so you've come, I'm, I'm assuming, because you've got a lovely accent, I'm assuming you're from Ireland. Yeah. Lovely. Which, which part? Dubbers. 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 <laughs> I love Dubbers. Uh, uh, so, so that's Dublin, isn't it? That's not like, because with Ireland, you never know if they're just shorthand in Dublin or there is an actual fucking place called Dubbers. <laughs> Oh, you don't know Dubbers? It's in County Arthur. <laughs> you know, oh no, they just only know Belfast and Dublin because they're fucking racists. Um, can I just say, I'm nailing these accents today. I'm very pleased with myself. I've done Posh, I've done Dublin, I did a bit of Scouse. Fucking multi talented. Um, <laughs> you know, and I eat. What, sorry? Was that a Dublin it was a Dublin accent, yes. Um, <laughs> Fucking hell. I'm glad you're in a fucking budget hotel, love. <laughs> Jesus Christ. All right, so you're from Dublin. What, what do you do when you're in Dublin? Uh, top secrets. Top secrets? Yeah, fuck off. You're some sort of <laughs> Dublin spy. That's fucking... When, when someone from Dublin it says, what do I do? And they go, top secrets. Fifteen years ago, people would fucking shit themselves about that. <laughs> Fucking looking around Liverpool one go, it's another fucking Arndale centre this. Get the fuck out. <laughs> that was the bit where it was too far, wasn't it? Good. All right, okay. I didn't even get your name. She gives, she gives men a rub down. She gives, she gives men a rub down. It's, it's amazing talking to you as a person. Because, because you give me answers to questions that I haven't fucking asked. So I just talk to you and you go... She's got a vagina like a four-leaf clover. And you go, what? <laughs> what the fuck have you just said? I That's... What, sorry? I don't know if she has a vagina like a four-leaf clover. Oh, because she doesn't, she doesn't want to go less. Well, you know what? It's, it's 2018, and people should be allowed to do whatever they are allowed to. I don't know why the fuck this has turned into Jeremy Kyle all of a sudden. <laughs> <laughs> giving you counselling. I went... I went, to, um, I went to Dublin a couple, of, uh, a couple of years ago with my missus. I love Dublin, by the way. It's a great place, isn't it? It's nice. Yeah, yeah. yeah, it's good. I mean, I like... There's not much to do, in my opinion, because it's like... It's, it's like you've got the Guinness fucking yeah. museum thing, and then you've got the Jameson distillery, and then you've got the... Do you want to go and see the fucking Trinity College? And you're like, I am too pissed, mate, and I'm just... <laughs> I just, just fucking go down Temple Bar and pay 47 quid for a fucking JD and Coke, you know? <laughs> We went, on the last day, we did that thing where, you know when you're having a weekend break and you always book like an early flight going out and a late flight going back? Our flight going back was like 10 p.m. So we had all day to kill in Dublin with our luggage. We had nothing to do. We had literally no money left, nearly. So we went to 
this all you can eat uh it was like madagascan food and i was like i'm fucking on that because i don't know what madagascan food is <laughs> i don't even know if they have food over there so i'm gonna fucking see what this is about it was just various spicy meats it was amazing but because we had nothing to do we just sort of ate until we were full and then we stayed there and digested and just sort of pushed more spicy meaty food <laughs> we were waddling down old connell street like fucking march of the penguins <laughs> like this <laughs> And then we came across a, it was a, a Thai massage place, and we had literally just enough uh, euros to do it, um, uh, because you have stupid money over there. Um, um, and we, we went to this Thai massage place, and we got a couple's massage, and we both sort of stripped off, and we led on the, uh, on the thing like this. And this, <laughs> these two Thai women came in, right, and they massaged me, and I must have let off about 103 farts. <laughs> Cheers. And um, my missus was looking at me like, what the fucking hell do you think you're doing? And I was like, babe, I don't even know that I have these farts. She's just pushing them out of me like a fucking musical instrument. <laughs> do you, know, you know, like sometimes when you have a fart, you go, this is going to be uncomfortable. Should I fart or should I just hold it? Yeah, fuck it. You know what I mean? She got, this Thai woman, she got on my back right and she started walking on my back like they do. And then she walked back just above the crack of my ass. I let out the biggest fucking fart. And she just sort of went, she, she went, she went, oh, oh, <laughs> whoop, whoop. <laughs> just carried on like it was no thing. But I swear to God, I saw my Thai masseuse look at my girlfriend's Thai masseuse with just a look that says, this is the only time that I think I'd rather be sucking dick right now. This is just... <laughs> This year, I'd rather be back in Thailand just, bah, you know. Uh. <laughs> <laughs>